Low testosterone is more than just a sluggish sex drive. It's one of the more frustrating symptoms, yes, but things like fatigue, increased body fat, reduced muscle mass, and irritability are also associated with low testosterone or low T. Men should know that it's completely normal for T levels to decline over time. However, it's much more common among those over the age of 80 than younger ones. As such, if you're on the younger side of the spectrum and have low testosterone levels, then you should start making some lifestyle changes. These natural tweaks, such as managing stress and getting enough sleep, can go a long way in increasing your T levels, and we will be talking a lot more about them and many others in this video. So don't go just yet, and keep a close eye on the natural ways to double your testosterone levels. Number 1. Balanced Diet Your diet plays a major role in your testosterone production. A healthy diet benefits your T levels in two primary ways. Number one, promoting weight loss and a healthy weight, and number two, reducing the risk of blood sugar spikes. Men who are obese are much more likely to have a reduced level of testosterone. In particular, excess abdominal fat is a common culprit. A high amount of this type of fat can lead to a higher production of aromatase, an enzyme that converts testosterone into estradiol. A healthy diet includes plenty of fruits and vegetables, moderate amounts of healthy fats and lean protein, and whole grain carbohydrates. In addition, you may also consider incorporating more foods that are rich in nutrients that are essential for maintaining optimal testosterone levels. These foods are as follows. Fatty fish. Fatty fish like sardines and salmon are packed with vitamin D, zinc, and omega-3 fatty acids, all of which are important for hormonal health. Dark leafy greens. They are an excellent source of micronutrients, magnesium being one of those. It's a mineral that's essential for maintaining optimal testosterone levels. Avocados. These tropical fruits are rich in healthy fat, which promotes healthy hormone levels. Plus, avocados have magnesium and boron, which can help with testosterone levels. Berries, cherries, and pomegranates. High in flavonoid antioxidants, these fruits can help shield testosterone-producing cells against damage all the while increasing testosterone production. Eggs Egg yolks are loaded with protein, healthy fat, and selenium. Selenium in particular helps enhance testosterone production. Shellfish Oysters and clams in particular are amazing sources of zinc, omega-3s, and selenium, which support optimal T levels. Exercise is another great way of naturally boosting your testosterone. More about this next. Real quick, hit that like button and let's get back into it. Number 2. Proper Exercise Exercise increases testosterone in two major ways. First off, specific forms of exercise can trigger the body to produce more testosterone. And second is that exercise helps build more muscle mass and decrease body fat. Adipose tissue or body fat turns testosterone into estrogen. Therefore, the less fat you get, the more T you have. Keep in mind the following things. Focus on lifting weights. If you want to double your testosterone levels, you should start with lifting, lifting heavy to be exact. A short circuit using weight machines won't be enough. To maximize your testosterone production, consider using compound lifts like squats, deadlifts, shoulder presses, and bench presses. Then, make sure to go for high volume. According to studies, higher volume workouts lead to higher T levels. Try HIT training too. Besides weightlifting, studies have discovered that HIIT workouts can greatly increase testosterone levels. HIIT involves short, intense bursts of exercises, then followed by a less intense recovery period. You do the entire cycle many times throughout the workout. Not only does HIIT training increase testosterone, but it also improves athletic conditioning and fat metabolism and boosts muscle strength. Do not overtrain. Training every day until exhaustion might seem to be the best way to boost your T levels, but it is not. It can, in fact, sabotage your testosterone levels. Studies have shown that overtraining can significantly reduce T levels. Sure, it's important to exercise hard, but it's even more important to allow your body to rest and recover from all the damage brought by your rigorous workouts. Have at least two days a week of rest. Up next is how supplements impact your T levels, so make sure to stick around. Number 3. Supplements and Vitamins did you know that vitamin D can contribute to increased testosterone levels? So, if you can just go outside and bask in at least 15 minutes of direct sunshine every day, then that would be great as doing so would be enough to keep your vitamin D levels managed. You may also eat more food sources high in vitamin D such as fatty fish, fortified milk, and cereal products. Another is DHEA supplements. DHEA is a hormone that aids in testosterone production and other hormones that influence body composition. 
as you age, DHEA levels drop, as do testosterone levels. In a study on older men taking DHEA, it was found that DHEA supplements produce small but significant positive effects on body composition. Magnesium supplementation can also help, especially in regulating testosterone levels. You may also increase your magnesium intake through diet. Magnesium-rich foods include dark leafy greens and whole grains. Creatine is another good one. It is known for its small yet reliable testosterone increases. Research from years ago found that college football players who took creatine supplements for at least 10 weeks had higher levels of testosterone. Creatine occurs naturally in fishes like tuna and salmon as well as beef. Lots of people are sleep-deprived, another contributing factor to reduce T levels in men. Thus, it's important to get more and better sleep to naturally increase your testosterone. We'll talk more about this here. Number 4. Enough Sleep Lack of sleep can harm the levels of hormones and chemicals in the body that are necessary to function properly. And yes, among those include testosterone. Also, the body produces nearly all the testosterone it needs for the day while you're sleeping. Such an increase in the level of tea that you experience at night is one of the reasons you wake up with a morning wood. Hence, if you aren't getting enough quality sleep, your production of testosterone isn't as efficient or effective as compared to when you're sleeping enough. Researchers found that a whole week of restricted sleep can already cause daytime T levels to drop by up to 15%. Meanwhile, testosterone decreases brought by normal aging is just 1-2% to per year. Plus, better and more sleep helps manage cortisol. Find out next how this stress hormone is connected to your T levels. Number 5. Stress Management Like sleep, stress influences your well-being, including your T-levels. When you face stress, your body releases a hormone called cortisol. Cortisol helps your body prepare and respond to the stressor. It's all good until you're stressed more often than not. Chronic stress or prolonged exposure to cortisol can reduce the level of free testosterone. Thankfully, there are ways to reduce stress since, after all, there's always going to be something to stress over about life. One of the best ways to manage stress is to meditate. Do it for 20 minutes a day and you'd be surprised by how something seemingly ordinary can make significant changes. You can also simply do something you enjoy even if it's only for a few minutes a day. Practicing deep breathing exercises is also perfect for minimizing stress. Still not making any progress? Get yourself checked at the hospital. What many guys fail to realize is that low testosterone is commonly caused by something else and does not entirely occur on its own. And by something, we mean one or more underlying health conditions that you might not know you have. These health conditions include obesity, type 2 diabetes, obstructive sleep apnea, and metabolic syndrome. Low testosterone can also be due to medications for a health condition you currently have, or a previous therapy you've received, say radiation or chemotherapy. Having your body evaluated by a doctor, specifically one who specializes in men's health, can help you understand what might be causing this phenomenon. Moreover, doctors can help you decide which of those five changes might be the most crucial for you. Alternatively, they may refer you to a specialist who can help cure your underlying health condition contributing to lower T levels. They may also recommend testosterone treatment for you. It's great that you're doing those things to boost your testosterone levels. However, you should also know that all your efforts can easily go down the drain if you aren't careful with your diet. You may not know this, but foods can negatively affect your T-levels. Click this link to know what foods you should be avoiding.